Okay, here's the uh, here's the prep. Um, I don't know how I'm going to put this video together, but there was a there was a little minor mishap with uh, the uh, Red Scorpion Six WSK, and um, this is what I started. Um, I roughed this ugly ass looking spoon out, um, and then I was working on this. Um, it's just it's ash juniper. But I got to a point, and then I was just uh, doing the stabs like this, stab, twist, stab, twist, and bent the tip on that RS, um, that Red Scorpion 6. So, I um, feel pretty bad about that, and uh, not really sure what's going to happen, but we'll see. Uh, hopefully, we can get a remedy on that, and uh, uh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. So anyways, this was the prep that I started. And uh, I was going to cook a piece of salmon that I have. I'm just at the house in the back and all that. So um, no big wilderness experience here. But uh, anyways, got a bunch of prep going. I finished it up. Uh, this was, um, I'm not sure of the whole, the whole history on where the blade came from or the handle. Uh, the handle is outrageous work, um, but I got this from a fellow tracker packer, um, and it's a stainless blade. It's everything that a lot of people don't like, I guess, um, including the, the WSK shape, but I finished doing this with it, so I um, haven't had any problems, and the tip didn't bend, so... Um, Anyways, it's it's a little different than than like the the tops the tops blade, but I've been I've been wanting I've been using a little bit, but I've been wanting to do a video about this because it's actually a pretty pretty solid little tool. Um,
Okay, here's my half bait plank cooking. <laughs> it's looking good, smelling good, salmon, so I'm happy. Um, I just did it on juniper ash and coals here because uh, once it gets burnt down to this point, I've never had any had any problems with it impairing the flavor of anything really once it's burnt down to coal so just pretty much putting off heat there's a little bit of cedar there or uh, ash juniper um, good god why do I always go on and on about that 